Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Danielle. For those of you who do not know me, hi, welcome. I'm so glad you stopped by today. Today I'm just gonna kind of do a chit chat, get ready with me, talk about life a little bit, but here's the exciting part. I'm gonna use these together. This is the Violet Ink from Menagerie Cosmetics and this is what it looks like. It's so pretty, it's so pretty. You can't handle it, it's so pretty. Look at those purples, it's so pretty. And then we have the Whale Song palette because I finally picked it up and I'm gonna show it to you even though most of you have probably seen it because I'm excited to own it. But I felt like it would be so much fun to play with these together. So that's what we're gonna do today while talking about my life. Yeah, and my, my no buy slash low buy and kind of talk about that in depth and just, you know, life. This life is great. <sighs> also, my hair is down. It's not cooperating any other way I try and do it, so. It's down. It's a mess. It is what it is. Yeah. <laughs> um, anything new going on? I mean, there's like new things in my life, but not like fun things. I mean, at all, no fun things. <laughs> um, so let's just, let's just start with the, the no buy. Like the actual roots of the no buy. Like, let's go there. Let's, let's just, let's, let's just go there. Um, So a lot of you know that I'm on a low buy, but, and that it was originally only gonna be for a month. I'm still kind of allowing myself some like birthday fun. Gosh, this looks great. Okay, that looks done, bye. <laughs> I'm still allowing myself some birthday fun and things like that. I'm not gonna just walk away from that right now, but, so I'm on a no buy essentially until October and then it's gonna switch into a low buy and a very, very strict low buy because I need it to be that strict because life. So I'm gonna go into the Violet Ink and I'm gonna use Iron Grip first. I kinda wanted to do a, I, I woke up this morning, I was like, you know what, it'd be great. It was like a purple, blue, and green look. And then I was like, oh, I have the perfect palettes because this came in the mail yesterday. And I screamed a little bit and I got excited and then something else came in the mail and it destroyed my life. So essentially I have to be a responsible adult right now. Like there's no other if, ands, or buts. So my makeup spending just in general needs to slow down. Um, because I have to be the adult I never wanted to be. <laughs> um, if you guys don't know, I I tend to be very much like a kid. I, I, I just, yeah. But with going through divorce and everything else and looking at my finances and realizing, oh, we're gonna have to rein some things in. And it's not, going to be the easiest for me. I struggle with my spending. I know this about myself. I, I'm i pretty good. So here's the funny thing. Like if I have extra money, I typically spend it. I save a little bit of my money. Um, and But I, I always make sure my bills are paid first. Well, <laughs> life kind of threw a curveball into my life and has made things a little bit more difficult because I found out I owe on something that I thought was paid. <sighs> I, I'm just, I've found out a lot of things that I'm not exactly happy about lately and it has been one of the most frustrating things ever and just a lot of the lies that were told and things and um, I'm, I'm just in a sticky kind of situation right now and I have to kind of 
rain in on things and and <clears throat> be the bigger person that I don't want to be because I don't I don't want to be it so I'm going to take the shade dive next I'm going to place it next to that purple I kind of took the purple a little further over I got a little like excited yeah more like ranty so with that being said and with you know my finances kind of where they are and I'm not going to say it's no fault of my own. Um, it is and it isn't. And it's just, that's just, that's just life at this point. Like I can't go back and change some of the things I did. I wish I could in some, in some aspects. Um, but no, it's, it's totally, it's totally what it is. <laughs> and I am going to have to make some changes. I mean, it's it's going to be for the better in the long run anyway. And things like that. But I'm, I'm still a little... <laughs> I wouldn't even say a little. I'm a lot frustrated. I'm a lot angry at certain situations. And just where things are for me at this stage of my life it is very aggravating and very frustrating and some of you might be wondering why are you being so honest because i don't feel the need to lie or hide things because that's not really who or how i do things and if you've been with my channel for a while you know that i don't tend to beat around the bush and be quiet about things but Again, like in the long run, things will get better. I'm not, how do I want to phrase this? I'm not like the most bitter about things. I'm just, I'm just a little frustrated and I think I'm allowed to be a little frustrated. I think it's going to be okay that I'm frustrated. Um, and I'm just very lucky to have parents and things who are willing to help me <laughs> navigate this time in my life and, you know, a new boyfriend who is a very good guy and I'm in a co completely different kind of situation than I ever expected to be at this stage of my life so I don't think anyone plans to be where they are sometimes sometimes things work out for the better sometimes things work out for the worse sometimes you get put in situations you never thought you would ever be in and you find yourself having to do things a little bit differently. And that's kind of where I find myself. So the next shade I'm going to go into is Kelp. I'm going to put that next to the blue shade Dive on my eyes. So with that being said, I am going to have to kind of, again, rein in my spending. Even though part of me doesn't really want to because I like buying makeup. And it's not that I'm never gonna buy makeup again, it's just I'm gonna have to be really selective because this, so the no buy goes until October 8th, which is my birthday. Um, and then, uh, and then I'm going to go on a low buy. So my low buy rules are more like, category based so I have to run out of things or really really want something because I'm gonna allow myself like once in a while to buy an eyeshadow palette I want because eyeshadow is my favorite thing to play with um, but things like foundations and blushes and uh, even mascaras just kind of like the base makeup products I don't need any of that stuff that's not a need unless I run out. So with that being said, it's going to be more run like that. And it's going to have to be. Because your girl has no other twists. No other toys. But I'm kind of excited about what this actually means for my channel. And some of you guys might be like, well, how is this going to be a good thing for your channel, Danielle? It really is. 
it really 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 is going to be a good thing for my channel because I'm going to have to get more creative with the content I put out I'm going to have to play with things that I haven't played with in a while and, and just kind of do different things and I'm excited about that I'm excited about the future of my channel right now and it's weird because I thought I had to buy all this stuff and I like every now and then I get caught up in that like oh I need new stuff <clears throat> I'm gonna go into the shade Mimic here and I'm going to place this on my lid towards where I place the purple shade and kind of take it as far as I placed the purple matte iron grip but I just think it's going to give me kind of a different kind of a different kind of energy on my channel and less about getting the new. I'm still going to talk about like some of the new releases and things and possibly what I want to purchase or what I'd like to add to my collection, but I want to do things where I start to create palettes and things based on um, what I have in my collection. Like if I see an eyeshadow palette I really want, I want to kind of go through and search my collection and really kind of find the different things. Then I'm going to take the shade Whale Song and I'm going to use the same brush because I used one side of it and the other side is clean. So I'm going to take the shade Whale Song and place it next to that purple shade. Ooh. Pretty. Ooh, that is, mm-hmm. And if you guys haven't already noticed, this is going to be more about the eye look than, than anything else. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. I have a hard time when life decides to just throw curveballs I was not expecting. But, I digress. <laughs> Anyway, off of that subject, I just kind of wanted to give you guys a heads up. I will do a more kind of in-depth video about my no-buy, low-buy stuff um, as things progress and as I kind of figure out more about what my finances are going to look like and just different things like that. But I'm not going anywhere. I am planning a whole bunch of videos and, and just trying to let my creativity uh, shine. So then I want to go into the shade Splash here. Ooh, pretty. I'm really liking these shimmers. And no, I did not spray any of them. Sometimes I like to see how they, they'll work before I go in and spray them, and these are working beautifully. <clears throat> Dating is still going really well. I'm having fun. I've just been working, um, you know, things like that. I did have kind of a vlog video that I still need to edit it I just have way too much to edit with it and I don't know exactly when I'm gonna get around to doing that but um, Dustin and I went to Arizona which I have always wanted to go to Arizona I it was so cool um, we had bears and stuff right next to our car, wolves, just just different animals and just the, how close we were to these like predators was just so interesting and so crazy and we watched, you know, wolves would get right in front of your car and not allowed you to move. They were like sniffing cars and, you know, just very kind of in depth. And one of the things I thought was really kind of cool and they explained this because we later went on like the actual bus tour through there and I got a lot of amazing pictures of the animals and things on that. Um, I'm going to go into the shade Reef and place that where I put all of the white. But I just thought that was so cool and they kind of explained that all of these animals are sent to them 
from like game and fish who find them injured and all this stuff and they really can't fend for themselves um, in the wild so they take it upon themselves to take care of them. They are not funded by the government or anything so they're just, they they get all their funding by people visiting it and stuff and like it is, it is so someplace that I would go again because it was just a really, really cool thing and I am so glad I got to go and uh especially with Dustin because he likes a lot of the same things I like and we just we had a blast and I really kind of needed something like that it just it, it made me so happy <laughs> the next shade I'm going to go into is pearl here and I'm going to use this as an inner corner highlight and a brow bone highlight but it was just it was a lot of fun and if you're ever in Arizona, I highly recommend going. It's near Flagstaff. This is so pretty. This is a pretty, pretty shade. Um, but I highly recommend going because it was so cool. My next kind of trip I want to do at some point, well, I guess this is just generally some point in my life is I want to hike down the Grand Canyon and go to have a soup eye. You wanna know what I noticed? I haven't done my liner. I might not do eyeliner with this. I know, shocker. Uh, I think I'm just gonna take my mascara and do that and I'm not sure what lip I'm gonna do. But yeah, well, the next thing I kinda wanna do is hike down have a soup eye, which means that I'm gonna have to start hiking and getting myself ready for something major like that. That's probably not gonna happen for a while. Uh, but it's something I've always wanted to do and just haven't gotten the chance to. So, major, major goal. Also exciting thing, because it's gonna happen, but, so, uh, Dustin likes the same kind of music I like. I know, I sound like a teenage girl, but it's just, it, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of a big deal. I don't know, it's, it's still kind of one of those things where I'm like, where I know a lot of people are kind of weirded out that I'm dating someone or that I'm just kind of living my life. Not really anyone here online. Most of you are like, yay, you're dating someone, oh my gosh, yay, move on. So. But people in my actual life are just like, I don't know if you should be doing that. Blah, 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 blah. I don't know. And I just want to throw one of these Pat McGrath glosses on. And I kind of want to do this one. This is in Divine this is in divine rose so i think we're gonna i'm just i'm gonna throw it on i'm just gonna i'm just gonna put it on also if you see this thing on my lip a toddler head butted me that's a story for another day <laughs> a few uh years down the road maybe <laughs> But yes, I got headbutted by a toddler. Well, here is the final look. I really, really like it a lot. And I know it's kind of weird to pair with like a red shirt. I might go change my shirt, but this is the look I wanted to do today. And you guys will have to let me know what you think down below. Sorry that this isn't super upbeat. I just kind of wanted to let you guys know the boring things that are going on in my life. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please give it a like, subscribe to my channel if you have not already, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!